The Dive Heart Foundation has helped thousands of people with disabilities experience the freedom and adventure of scuba diving. Joining us now to discuss the advantages of scuba therapy is founder and president Jim Elliott. Thanks for coming back and visiting oh. us. You know, you're a former Tribune employee, yep. so I good am, to be yeah. back in the building and, yeah. and see WGN things. Radio. I was yeah. here years ago. Yeah. 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 All right, let's talk about how you got into uh, figuring out that scuba was a perfect a vehicle, I should mm -hmm. say, for people with disabilities. Well, I had been guiding and teaching uh, blind skiers for decades. Wow. So I saw it change lives, and I'd been diving since college because as a journalism major, I thought if I ever meet someone like Jacques Cousteau, <laughs> I'd better not a scuba dive, right? I mean, really, it was just another arrow in my quiver as a reporter. And I said, oh my God, this is amazing. You know, it's like jumping off a building and hovering, like being a superhero. So I, I decided I wanted to be an instructor. Of course, then you have a family, and that you know, detains yeah. everything. But um, yeah, um, I left the media business, left CLTV, um, and decided to start this nonprofit and don't draw a salary. We're 22 years old this year. Wow. And uh, we do programs all over the world. And but what does it do for people with disabilities? Well, the, the thrill for me is um, taking someone out of a wheelchair who's never been in the water before yeah. and getting them to stand up and they look down, they go, oh my God, I'm standing up for the first time since okay. my injury. Or if, oh. if you have cerebral palsy, maybe the first time in your life because you're kind of a slave to gravity. But I would imagine how scary that's got to be because water in itself is, can be dangerous and you add a dis disability to yeah. it. It's got to be a very frightening and liberating experience at the same time. you got to wrap your head around it. The, the yeah. thing that, that, that I always laugh at is when the person for the first time puts their face in the water with a regulator and a mask and breathes in and then goes, yeah. I can't do this, I can't do this. And I just laugh, I go, your brain's saying, what are you doing, stupid? Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. You're, you're not supposed to breathe underwater. So those combinations of wrapping your head around that and then getting people out, you know, with mobility issues, mm -hmm. especially in a zero gravity environment where they can get range of motion benefits. And that's why we do research with university medical centers all over the, all over the world, really, to start looking at some of the benefits. Like we did the first study on autism and scuba therapy with Midwestern University yeah. in Downers Grove mm -hmm. uh, because for kids with autism, you know, pressure is a kind of a therapy. They have pressure vests and weighted blankets yeah. and sensory deprivation rooms. Well, when you go underwater, it eliminates surface distractions and helps you focus. And when mm. you take photos and video of the kid, it's like, oh my God, they're like rock stars. They show it. And then they self identify as a diver instead of somebody with disability. Does that then translate a little bit to their life outside mm -hmm. of the water, like they can remember it and and it helps mm -hmm. them? Yeah. Okay. yeah, it makes them, it helps them take on other challenges that they wouldn't have taken on mm -hmm. before. Mm -hmm. I tell people it's really not about scuba diving, it's like taking the unrealized human potential that exists in people with disabilities and, and creating a paradigm shift. Now it's not Johnny in a wheelchair, it's Johnny the scuba diver. Yeah. Yeah. Now when they say, wow, if I can do this, I can do anything, then you point them towards coral reef restoration, marine biology, oceanography, make them good stewards of the environment, which we need. Okay. Yeah, for sure. But in some cases, you do have to modify the equipment in order for them to have this experience. We, yeah, we use, we use equipment like the full face mask. Okay. Um, this is for somebody that can't hold a regulator in their mouth. Yep. I had a Marine one time, a grenade had taken off part of his face. So we, we use this and we put surgical tubing on the inside of the skirt to make it conform to his face. But um, autism, you know, we have folks that are nonverbal. Sure. And so we use this, but it has comm units. And we, um, we actually last year took a quadruple plegic gentleman on a shark dive in the Bahamas and we had four of these units so he could talk to the boat and his wife was on the boat and we did it for a, a TV show and it just changed yeah it was amazing oh, wow. and the cool thing about this too is I'll carry a long hose so he has a short hose that goes to his tank yep. and then what I'll do is well, before we get him back on the boat we'll take his gear off we'll open the surface port so he can breathe but yeah. then I'll pop this on really quick close the surface port and now we can transfer him back up onto the transom of the boat which is makes it safer because yes. we have a lot of extra hose, extra hose. Mm. and we've been using this technique for like 20 years yeah and this is the exact same technique remember the soccer kids they got out of time yeah, 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 yeah. yes. this is the same technique that they oh. use to to do that. Oh, so the work is translating in other yeah. areas. In other, okay, so, and these are specialized gloves. These are, yeah, these are web gloves. So if you can't use your legs, if you can't use traditional fins, you, you can put force. these on your hands. Yeah, and, and manipulate yourself through the water. And we dress individuals with disabilities like quadriplegics. So what we'll do is slide their hand through the wetsuit. Yeah. And then if you pull, pull the end, 
Ta -da. Oh, yeah, ta -da. it comes off really easy. Oh, wow. Oh, oh this my is amazing. I use, it, I use it to put on my wetsuit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they are funny. Yeah, that's amazing. Yeah. 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 Seems like that thing's a little difficult when to get, get into. Wet, they're hard but, to and you guys just got back from Malaysia, so you're not talking about just doing some diving in pools around town. You guys are going everywhere in the world. We, yeah, China, Australia, Israel, the UK, all over the Caribbean. Yeah, hundreds of cities in the US. In 22 years, we've really changed the entire dive industry. Uh, I started doing this in 97, and we incorporated in 2001. And, and here we are. I mean, we, we actually uh, just got two patents on a design for a pool. We want to build a deep warm water therapy pool uh -huh. here in the Chicagoland area. Oh, and we're going to wow. do, uh, so I, I had plaques made, but I have paper covering the actual design because we're going to do a reveal party in November and we're going to kind of blast it out there and show the design and everything. But This is yeah. so awesome. It'll be cool. Oh. Bra uh, dive heart. I was getting ready to say brave heart. You <laughs> got right? me, right? It's not a, it's not a bad mistake yeah, to yeah, make. Yeah. Yeah. We're talking about the correlation between the two. All right, diveheart.org is where you get more information. I imagine people can make contributions there as well. Please, yes. Yeah, individuals are our big, you know. And you're look always looking for instructors, people, you're training people to volunteers. Volunteers, instructors, yeah, That's participants. That's people who actually want to participate. Yeah, I was yeah. going to yeah. say, we, want to get more information. We don't charge for our pool program, so if, you know, a kid or an adult with a disability wants to get in the water, just let us know. That's amazing. Yeah, amazing Thank you work. so much. Thank you for yeah. coming in and sharing it with Thank us. You. Mm -hmm. All right. Fantastic.